honestly, I did 2,000 commercials before I did a film. So, I mean, I could hit the ball from any direction. Right. And so I was always able to assess um, quite categorically, a little bit like I learned from advertising, am I communicating? If I'm not communicating, the ad's not working. I was in the editing room, I'm going, mm, this wrong. I, I could put my finger on what was wrong. Mm. So did you, was everything at your disposal in terms of the most current cameras, the most current technology as you started out? Or was that always, were you no. always ahead of that curve? No, no, no. My current thing was finishing as an art student at the Royal College of Art, trained to be in advertising. Then I, I knew I would either go a little bit of advertising, I would probably want to go into television, which is BBC, because that would get me close to directors. And I didn't know how to become a director. There was no film school. So I was set designer. I was a very good designer. Mm -hmm. So I was given a job at BBC immediately with no assistance. I just went straight and they gave me a play. And I was in there for three years as a bloody nuisance as a direct, as an art director. I was all, I learned to cheat bureaucracy and always get more money, more money out of, more stuff out of than the budget would allow. I was, I was really good at that. And uh, then I eventually at BBC, I was given a production course, learned to be a director. Two months course, I got a show. I was up and running. Mm -hmm. But um, it was a wonderful period. In those phones, you know, there's no cell phones in those days. But uh, and I was already moonlighting, doing television commercials. I was working at BBC, which is sacri you know, just about as close to getting your head chopped off if you can, because you're working for the competition. And I used to carry around a little bag of coins because I knew every phone booth that worked from me to Chelsea, where I was doing a lot of commercials. Mm -hmm. And if I had a problem, I would call from the box saying, problem, any problems? i will be there in an hour. Mm -hmm. And I'd go and set the television commercial and drive back to BBC. So it was like wonderful. It was, I was speedy Gonzalez. <laughs>